Hey, what is up, guys? Dark Ross about to extreme into of all time. And today I'm gonna be reacting to the Milan 2 channel's uh, video. So apparently I've been uh, watching it um, because it's pretty cool. So uh, yeah, I've been a fan of his uh, channel for a while. So if you guys are like, yo, you can just like rather watch uh, the Milan 2 channel's um, video. And um, it's uh, pretty good. Yeah, and uh, you know, I'm just kind of like it. And, uh, and I pretty much like to watch, but I'm going to do it anyway. So this is called Tilly to the Rescue. Now, I'm not going to like pause it during the video, and um, because why not? And I just pretty much probably thought it would be nice if I could keep watching it. Yeah, so yeah. So anyway, guys, let's get this started. Let's begin. Funding for the railways of Crotunia, Tilly to the Rescue has been provided by... I pretty much like... I haven't... Oh, wait. I remember this one. Here at Super Lanes, we're about fun, community, and involvement. Whether you're at the grill or the alley, at Super Bowl Lanes, it's always a good time. At Super Bowl Lanes, we care about the importance of family, teamwork, community, and of course, fun. Super Bowl Lanes is a proud sponsor of the Meal on Tune channel. Super Bowl Lanes, let the good times bowl. Huh, I pretty much like... You know, I've always wished I want to go to the Super Bowl Lanes. <laughs> I guess if I were to go there, I mean, like totally though, but, I mean, but like, listen, all, like all I'm saying was that if I should go there sometime, like, I, I let him, like, you know, like, like I had no chance. All right, let's do it. I'm actually glad. All right, friggin' dog part pictures, I've, um. Oh, that's right! Happy birthday to the Railways of Crotonia! And so is the Milan 2 channel. Man, he's like a great YouTuber, I'd say. You know, I actually like him. I mean, his videos are amazingly extraordinary. I was actually glad that, like, someone. Wait, oh, wait, Luca Dollar. Wait, I may have known him, yeah. There it is, Tilly to the rescue. You know, it sure is great. I've been loving to watch this. Far away in the country of Crotonia, there lives a railway company called the Fantasyland and Fairy Tale Railway Traction Company Limited. There are many engines that live here who run the main lines and branch lines of Crotonia's railways. One of the smallest engines in the company was a switch engine named Tilly. She moved engines in and out of the sheds, sorted out all the coaches and wagons, and prepared and brought the trains for the big engines to take down the main line. The biggest diesel of the company hmm. was Farnsworth. Oh, Farnsworth. He adored pulling passenger trains over the mountains to the towns, but he loathed any goods train. Where are my coaches? Hold your wheels, Farnsworth. They're nearly ready. Well, hurry up. I can't waste time dealing with silly little engines like you. Oh. What do you mean, silly? Damn. I spend my days running things yards while you zoom down the main line with your coaches. Sheesh. Well, you work with freight cars. I work strictly with passenger coaches. I, that voice always sounds well, like Gordon. It's always him. Dirty thing. Well, then, you're a disposable engine, then. You won't be ready for emergency trains, then. D d d disposable. I'll have you know that I'm an indispensable engine. Bro, he's such a show off, like a lot. You're just as important to us big engines as that puny little tender engine from the circus or whatever. Who are you calling puny? Oh, my God! My God! My God! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Never mind. He's safe. He's all right. We're good. We may not be as hey, it's big, Casey Jr. But we're just as useful as you over gloss passenger engines. <laughs> oh, I didn't need this today. Good day, sir. Huh. I said good day. Nothing worse. Oh, wait, I remember him. Good day that second time. I don't care. Damn. 
Express runs right away? Sorry, Montana. It may sound like I have to do some rescheduling this morning. There's a slow goods train waiting at Selgrub Central Yards, and he wanted you to pick it up from all the stations in the Selgrub region, and start work on the express train. No problem, sir. Be back in a bit. I wish I could take a train outside of the yards. Oh, I do feel sorry for Tilly. Hey, it's Thomas. Hey, it's Thomas. He often stops by from the island of Sodor. This morning, he was just bringing a good strain of supplies to his own branch line in Fortunia. Good morning, Tilly. How are things in the junction? Same as always. Everybody's busy with their own jobs while I'm stuck shunting cards and coaches in the place. Huh. Don't worry, Tilly. I'm sure you'll get a chance to work outside Colville. I was a shunter like you when I started on Sodor. But once I learned enough and proved I was really useful, I got my own branch line and coaches. Really? Really. So don't worry. You work your hardest around here, and I know for a fact that you'll have a bigger job soon enough. Huh. Oh, sorry, Tilly. I have to take these supplies to Gradinia now. Have a good day. Huh, pretty much like to glad to, to see that Thomas was pulling his train. It was pretty great, actually. You know, I've always... Whoa, that setting's pretty amazing. Oh, God. Oh yeah, I am so sorry, guys. The I mean these ads I cannot be bothered with. They're like annoying me. Come on, hey. Selgrip Central Station is one of the biggest stations on Protunia. Every day, passenger trains rattle and roll in and out of the station, hauling coaches of all kinds to wow. the other towns and cities. And it was a very busy morning while Gordon was stuck outside the platform doing nothing. Hey, it's Gordon! Oh no, not him! Hello, slow coach. What are you doing sitting around? Don't you usually pull the express? I know, Farnsworth. I've been placed with another job. I've got to wait for my driver to pick up a schedule before I can set off. Oh, how quaint. I suppose it's only fitting for a ten- Don't you start oh. acting <laughs> like you were late by five minutes. Okay, that was not my fault. It was all because of that silly little circus engine. And a goat on the line. And an overheated radiator. Look, the point I'm trying to make is, at least I'm working on- Bounds worth. Oh, what luck. Can you leave your coaches here and help Gordon take some container wagons later? But- Oh, but, uh, splendid. Uh, uh, Head to the uh, goods yard, uh, find some uh, wagons, uh, and be at the Selgrub Bay container docks by 12 30. Oh, boy. <laughs> a big load to haul, so we'll need all the help we can get. Uh-oh. No shot. He's in trouble. What? You were saying? <laughs> okay, really funny on this guy, though. Oh no! Uh oh. Yeah, bro, that's his fault. You you could have left the, your train there, really. Finally, the rescue shunter rolled up along the other platform. She was delivering emergency supplies to all the stations on the main line. Morning, Montana. What's up with you? You look like your connecting rods are twisted. Uh, sorry, Callie. Just waiting around to collect a freight train to bring around the region this morning. I've got a long run across the border today, so I can't be late. Don't worry about it, Montana. You've been pulling the express for years. You'll catch up with it. Besides, I just heard that Henry and Chatsworth are managing the runs from Selgreb to the mainland for the morning. So you'll be covered until then. Well, I suppose you're right. Wow. Thanks for letting me know, Callie. Anytime, old timer. Attention. Hmm. I usually know that character from Chuggington. <laughs> well, I best be on my way then. The station needs these supplies in case an emergency breaks out. I may have been wait, I may have not know her name, but I might remember Ow! <laughs> wait, wait, I think it's um I don't know, maybe I'll I'll figure out what the name is. Sorry. A little while later at Colville Junction, 
Tilly was feeling upset about Farnsworth's teasing and not being able to pull trains on her own. She wanted to do more than just moving cars and coaches in a single place. Hey, Tilly! Tilly? Are you okay? I suppose. Is there something bothering you? Sort of. Is it a bad thing to be a switch engine? Of course not. I used to be one before I joined the rescue team. Why do you ask? Well, Farnsworth keeps telling me about how I'm just a little switch engine moving real engines around the train yard. He always makes me feel like I've got the lowest job in the yard, while all the other trains get to travel. But how could they travel without their wagons? Should the big engines move back to collect their wagons, risking hitting the points or colliding into another train? Hmm. It's your job to keep other engines safe when collecting their trains. And look at the other little engines of our railways. Tracy works as a shunter. Oh, Tracy from the little engine I could. Emma works at the docks and on the seaside branch. And Ivor. Oh, Ivor. Wait, I remember him. He sure keeps a cool head running from the coal mines to the seaside branch and all around Crotonia. So you see, just because you're not as big as everyone else doesn't mean you can't do more than they can. Your size is what makes you unique. Really? I wouldn't say it if I didn't know. Huh. Uh-oh. There hey Timothy! Uh-oh, this is bad. Oh no, watch out, watch out. Oh, uh oh, whoa! Oh. Wait a minute, you would never even try to try it. Alright, Tilly, come on, get it. Uh-oh. Oh no. Watch out, watch out. Oh! Come on, break! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Let's go! Let's go! Come on, hit it with it, Tilly! Hit the brakes at the moment! Oh, oh, thanks, Tilly. I owe you one. Alright! Oh, wait, I can see, see Scruff in the background. See? I can see him. The yards wouldn't be the same without you! Oh my goodness, this is pretty great. It was kind of shocking how she saved the trucks. Meanwhile, at Selbra Bay Harbor, Farnsworth and Gordon were crossly sitting on the container dock, waiting for their flatbeds to be loaded up. Hurry up, Terex. I need to get out of these good duties as soon as possible. And my coaches will need to be taken over the mountain soon. Keep this smoking, you dumb. I'm working the best I can. Well, you should go. Whoa, yes, my gosh. With Gordon for once. Have me loaded first. You first? Who made you and These two are like so impatient all the time. They're not like, like, like a lot crazy. Hey, it's salty, and there's, uh, there's, uh, Ariel? I think it's Ariel, I think, from The Little Mermaid. Yep, yep, that's the one. Hmm. I, I don't even know who plays, uh, Salty. I mean, I never... What happened next? Nobody quite knows. Farnsworth said he heard a conductor's whistle, oh. while Gordon said he heard nothing. Either way, Farnsworth started off. Oh Gordon no, this is bad. Done, behind, just as Salty and Ariel came back with the last shipment to go. Uh oh. What the? Gordon? Farnsworth? Hi, where are you two off to? Oh no. Wait, but that's someone from the little engine that could. My favorite. Oh boy! Oh wait, I, I remember that music. It's from Wallace and Gromit, I think, on the, on the train chase. I think. Watch out! Watch out! Oh no! Elsewhere, my 
Montana was finally making his way back to the junction with a loaded slow goods train when suddenly. Oh no, what happened? Sorry, Montana, but we gotta go back around the loop. We forgot the flatbeds for the DFA. I'm going to beat you, Bonsworth. No, you won't. Oh. 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 Salty? Why are we stopping? They be in top speed now, lass. Oh. No way we can get them now. What should we do? <sighs> not sure. They're used to racing. But I'm not sure if rule breaking's typical. Oh, dear. Oh. Hurry back, Salty. Uh, why? Just hurry back to the harbor quick. We've got to warn the other engines. Uh-oh. We keep racing like this. There's going to be a crash at the junction. I'm going to be late. Border special is gonna be stuck unless I get back in time. Uh oh. Wait a minute. Oh no. Holy mother may I saw it. Oh no. Oh no. Stop, 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 stop. Oh no. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh. What a shocker, man. Oh no, my dad. Oh no, no, not you too. Oh no. Not cool. Dang. Oh boy. Oh wait, I can see a uh, Spencer I'm the in the background. And I'm ready to roll. All right. Uh, I think the, I think some characters were in Chuggington and the ones in Thomas and Friends. So um, yeah. So I'm gonna keep that in mind. Yeah. Oh boy. Why do I get the feeling that these guys are so intense? Like like Farnsworth and um what happened to you? Oh, I was moving along the line and the signal was clear, but then they came along the next minute and the signal changed. You should have known we'd be coming. The signal should have been down for me. The signal for you? Ha! Huh. I was supposed to pull a fine passenger train over the... Oh boy, I always hate it when these guys argue all the time. that train is as precious as... Ow! Stop! Ow! You're acting worse than Montana should be. He's worked all morning with the slow freight all around Selgreb, while you two have been breaking safety regulations on the rails all morning. Oh. the intersection without warning other engines. Racing off in the station when you're not supposed to, and leaving coaches on the platform. And nearly sending engines straight through the buffers. Oh. Looks like you two will need more than just new paint to look better. Or worse, there might be cause of confusion delay. I'm sorry about the mess, Callie. The signal was cleared, but I guess I should have looked more carefully instead of rushing. I think you know what what may way would have been what nice. Sense? Um. The accident wasn't your fault. It was silly engines and a dozing signalman that caused the problem. You were simply too late. You've been working really hard from what I've heard. Still, hmm. we better try and get you guys back on track. Ah, jeez Louise. I guess they would have been better if they could have, like... Ah, jeez Louise. I guess it would have been better for these guys if they could have just, like, slowed down or something. Again with the ads. I'm so tired of it. <laughs> Chips Ahoy. Been a huge fan. You know, I've always been a huge fan of having Chips I mean, Chips Ahoy. Hey, it's Ivor! The Special Express train, the Fairy Tale Arrow, couldn't move anywhere. The manager of the railway company, Missy Ella, was on the platform listening to No, wait, Missy Ella! Please, Ella, I need to get back over the border by tonight. I kinda miss my connection back to Duckburg. I'm well aware of that, Scrooge, and we're doing the best we can to get everything under control and on time. Couldn't you find another engine to pull the train? But all of the other big engines are scheduled with trains. Everyone except... 
come you can't do it, Casey? Oh, Tilly, I'm sorry. Oh. I'm stuck on back to back goods runs to the freight yard. Oh, wait, I don't remember who plays uh, Casey Jr. in uh, in the Railways of Crotonia. Here, let me, um. I've got to go and get slice in the quarry and bring them to Gruffin Harbor. It's an urgent shipment. Well, I'm sure they'll find someone to pull the train. And I think I found just the engine for the job. Oh. You have? Yeah. And I'm looking at her and her back engine right now. Really? Me? Goldie Express? Yahoo! Sweet! Lily could hardly contain herself. After waiting for so long, she finally had a big train she could pull outside of the junction. Oh my goodness, I, I always just, just want to say thank God. I've always wanted to have her pull, pull the train like this. I'm glad, really. Soon, the pair of engines coupled up to the train. They were told that Henry and Sir Reginald would meet them at Selgrub Central and take over from there. The passengers quickly boarded the express coaches bound for Selgrub City and beyond. The baggage van's door banged shut. The drivers brought up steam. All right, there's Ivor. Blew his whistle, and the fairy tale arrow left the station. Wait, but do I notice? Oh wait. That's the same song! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, this is like one of the most greatest songs I've ever listened to, really. Oh my goodness, this is great, really. Oh my goodness, man. I mean, this is perfect. Henry, calm down, man. He said, wait. At last, tired, worn, but triumphant, Tilly and Ivor rolled up to the platform with the heavy coaches. Bubbling boilers. You made it just a minute before the deadline. Oh, that's one in the headlamp of Farnsworth. Serves him right for calling you silly little engines. Uh, okay, um, they're pretty nice, really. The way so that a shunter could couple the fairy tale arrow coaches to their train after the boarding was complete. And Tilly and Ivor left to go and reload their bunkers and water tanks for the return journey back to Colville Junction. A few days later, Sir Alan Featherington, the directing manager for all the Crotunian railways, and Miss Ella rounded up some of the engines and vehicles for a very special. Alright, there's Casey Jr., Tracy. Sweet. Ladies, gentlemen, engines, cars, buses, and coaches. We are gathered here today to honor a very special switch engine and her fellow tank engine friend. She has proven to be very brave when she's prevented a nasty disaster from happening in this very rail yard, helpful from her work here in the depot, and a dependable go-to engine from her readiness to help a bigger friend in need to take the express for him, with the help of another hard-working friend, of course. Tonight, we would like to thank you, Tilly and Ivor, for your hard work, bravery, and determination here in Colville Junction. Ivor shall receive his own vintage passenger run on the Seaside Railway, and to you, Tilly, for all that you've done around the junction. Oh! Oh, wait, that's right! Your oh. very own mail run. Sweet! Three cheers for Tilly! All right, Tilly! <laughs> My goodness, this is great. Now, even though she still works on shunting in the junction, Tilly has her own special job on the railway. 
pulling mail cars down all the branch lines on the railways of Crutunia. She loves working with her friends from the junction like Johnny and the Greendale Rocket, and Tracy from the Dreamfleet Rail Company. And her other friends like Thomas and Casey Jr. always make sure to give a friendly peep when they're on early morning jobs. Sweet, this is great. I love it. Engine number three on track one, you are clear for departure. I mean I can see Rosie um in the background. I, th I think you know what's actually great? It's everything I love. Wow. This is awesome, really. Alright, so Luca Dara is Henry, uh, Leo John's Gordon. Uh, oh, wait, Stephanie is Tracy, and. Oh, wait, Enterprising, of course, is in Casey Jr. Sweet. Man, this is pretty awesome. My goodness, this is pretty awesome. Nothing can stop us now. Man, you know what's amazing? His videos are incredible. Yep, a presentation. My gosh, this is incredible. I love it, man. Oh my goodness. <sighs> you know what's really awesome? It's everything, really. Like the models, um, the sets, voicing, and even so much more. He is like amazingly cool. In fact, he even commented one of my greatest videos about Happy Birthday, Mo the Milan 2 channel. This is amazing, man. My goodness. I mean, this is like one of my favorite things I was hyped for, but, uh, yeah, you know, I'm pretty much hyped, and, um, that one that is, yeah, it was pretty amazing, yeah, so, um, I pretty much love watching it, and it was pretty great, yeah, and also, um, can we give, like, a quick shout-out for the Milan 2 channel on YouTube, yep, oh my goodness, man, his, his channel is amazing, yeah, and here's the thing, though, um, he usually makes his own, uh, videos on, uh, at MMD, where he usually, like, he started making videos of the Rails of Crotonia, and I like his, um, videos and other stuff, and I, I, I mean, they're, like, amazing! I mean, oh my goodness, like, I mean, like, his videos are, are like, on fire, really. I'm, like, in complete shock right now, like, <laughs> I'm, like, I don't know, like, a little bit of crying in tears or something, I don't know. <laughs> I bet, like, maybe I would, like, I don't know, if I would, like, try to, um, Maybe we react more to his videos uh, sooner or later, and uh, yeah, it could be like something I want to feel like uh, reacting to. Yeah. So, hey guys, I hope you all liked this video if you liked it, and let us know if you wanted to uh, see another reaction video. And I hope you guys liked my video. Like, subscribe, hit the like, and um, always um, uh, follow me on uh, YouTube, Divine Art, and even Discord. Hope you guys love this video, and don't forget to keep it rigid.